all my days if I could trade jobs with anyone. DJ. Oh my God, yes, great shower, Eden. Hey, uh, so I'm Chris, I'm Head of Commercial here at Komodo, uh, tasked with telling you a bit about myself. So, born and raised in Darlington, that may put a few people off, but I promise it's not all that bad. Lived in Newcastle last 10, 12 years, uh, joined Komodo just in time for the pandemic back in January 2020, been here four years and haven't looked back since. Well, and funny enough, Komodo actually did some work for my, my previous uh, place of work, Auction Information Systems, as it was at the time, now MRI. Um, shout out to those guys, great place to, to work as well. But Komodo actually helped design and build a tool at the time called Income Analytics, which was a, a fantastic product. And at that point, I'd seen firsthand the quality and the skill of work that Komodo could do. And therefore, when um, at the time I was approached for a job from them, it was a no-brainer. It was definitely the right, the right step for me. What have I been working on recently? Uh, better make myself sound busy now at this point, might I? Um, no, we've been working with a company called Infotechnics up in Aberdeen, helping them with some UX works so or revitalizing one of their core applications, making sure it was as optimized as possible for their users, which has been really fun. There's been some great concepts designed as part of that process and very much looking forward to the end result of that. Um, prior to that, helping uh, you know, helping companies like England Hockey and CA with some projects. Obviously, there's a limit to what I can say at this point, but they've been really useful. And then also helping the, the team grow internally. We've made a couple of internal hires, uh, which has been fun getting used to that and also looking at um, how we can improve from a leadership point of view. So there's been plenty going on, but all enjoyable. Um, shout out to Annie and the Zenith team, we did, some, uh, we did some leadership training, which was really cool. So the, the stuff around difference between management and leadership and when you need to embrace the role of one and focus on the other. And uh, I'm quite fortunate really in that my dad always, uh, from a young age, was talking to me about the difference between management and leadership and being a leader is, in, in my opinion and his opinion, is much more valuable to people, helping them, coaching them grow, rather than simply telling them which boxes and what to do. Um, there's a lot more to both camps than that, but yeah, really good training, really interesting, and some stuff can, can take out of that for sure. Uh, well, not lucky, but it was awesome earlier in the year because we got a chance to do some work with England Hockey, and as a hockey player myself, that was pretty cool. So I suppose natural evolution of that would be GB Hockey. That would be pretty awesome to go do some work with those guys. So if you're watching this video, uh, definitely, definitely hit me up on, on that. If I could only have one meal for the rest of my life, oh God, people that know me always take the mick out of me because I love a carbonara. Um, so there are other things out there, but I would probably have to go with a carbonara. I thought that would be banana and porridge. <laughs> what? No. <laughs> no. Okay, so if I could trade jobs with one person for a day, uh, yeah, that's 100% going to be pick a famous DJ. Uh, so maybe if I could swap with Tiesto for a day, that would be pretty cool. Or even James Hype, because he's killing it at the minute with his different mixing techniques and videos. So yeah, definitely swap with a, a famous DJ for a day to, to do a set in front of thousands of people, bring in the happiness and bring in the dancing. Yeah, I'm, I'm all in on that. <laughs>